Welcome to System76. My name is Alex Timmerman, and today I have the great pleasure of giving you an inside look into our R&D process. It's time to ask, what does R&D do? Over here, I have an initial prototype of our major at B4 chassis. So it's our new chassis that we're rolling out for our major models. Right off the bat, you're going to notice this giant cutout in here. You might be wondering why they do that. We did it so that you can swap motherboards as you please. So here is the IO plate that will ship with your model. And then should you in the future choose to upgrade to a different motherboard, you're free to do so. Another thing that we changed on our major chassis, this is our major chassis brace. Uh, this is our initial prototype. We noticed in our testing that it wasn't quite holding up to the standard that we'd like. So we've made some modifications to it. This is the main GPU brace. Again, a little less rigid than we would have liked, um, especially with GPUs out there getting bigger and thicker. So on our next prototype over here that I'm about to show you, you'll notice quite a change on this one. So if you'll give me a quick second. Boom, there it is. This is our new and improved major internal. So you can see the new um, IO shield being utilized here in this model. Another thing, that main chassis brace I was talking about earlier, we're using a new technology called roller beating that allows us to strengthen our sheet metal and add and increase the strength and rigidity of our chassis. Another thing you're going to notice is we beefed up our GPU support. So you can take this thick beefy GPUs and know that they'll be safe and sound inside of your chassis. But whether if it's us shipping it to you or you moving it out to a new location on your own. I wanna thank you for joining me on this journey today into the world of R&D. If you have any other questions regarding our R&D process or anything else we do here at System76, please do leave us a comment down below and we'll try to get to those questions be it in a video format or by responding to your comments. Thanks for watching and please do subscribe for future videos and other content that we'll be producing.